Every ML problem that you get in academia starts with given inputs X and uh, outputs Y, and you're supposed to predict Y from X. There's no Y here. This, the, no one's given you that. All we've gotten from the exchange is these like events that happen in real time. How do you turn those events into something a machine learning model can understand? What do you even predict? Do you can predict the future price that you can buy at, the future price you can sell at, you can predict some average of the two. It could be a classification problem, a regression problem. And that's all before you've even talked about the model. You haven't even gotten to like the definition of the problem yet. And there's already so much complexity. And then additionally, you are subject to incredibly tight latency constraints. Because first, these events are coming at you like over a thousand a second. You have to process them fast enough that if you decide you want to make a trade, you actually can get those shares before someone else. It's this kind of beautiful blend between like machine learning and incredibly difficult engineering problems. I think that's like very surprising to like most students who think that what we do is a much simpler version.